Welcome back to the Force Nines YouTube channel and welcome back to another Panini pack opening video. The World Cup is just over a week away. It's right around the corner and you know fever is really starting to hit its peak now. And I've still got 30 packs of uh, Panini stickers uh, that haven't been opened. So uh, over the next sort of week or so until the World Cup starts, uh, there will be two more videos where I'm going to be opening these. I'm going to open them all today and I'll upload uh, two videos. One going out probably on Tuesday. And then one either at the end of the week or the start of next week. So 15 more packs today and then 15 more packs in a later video. And then that will be all my packs and I've got no chance of finishing the book. But let's see if we can finish a team. If you're enjoying the videos make sure you drop a like down below, leave comments. And if you want to see videos as on my next and up on YouTube do hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell to receive updates for when I upload or go live. And follow me on social media so you don't miss out on any of my videos. So here we go, 15 more packs today, let's jump into it. Pack number one, let's see now, um, I don't really remember who we did and didn't get last time, but um, we'll, we'll, we'll just go through them and then we'll see what happens. So the first player today, so the first player today is a Croatian player, it's a defender from Sampdoria, his name is Ivan Strinic, that's the first player today. Uh, number two is an Icelandic uh, defender, again, from Rostov in Russia. His name is Sveria Ingasson. That's number two. Number three is an Iranian midfielder, plays for Amkar Perm, also in Russia. His name is Saeed Iza Talahi. That's number three in this pack. Number four is an Australian defender, plays for Bristol City. His name is Bailey Wright. And the final player, I've dropped everything. The final player in pack number one is the Argentina goalkeeper, Sergio Romero. I don't know about anyone else, but does anyone else miss Albon de Vizieri in the Argentina goal? I just I just remember that player more than anyone of like the old Argentina from like 2002. It's him and Batistuta and Crespo. That Argentina team was amazing. I mean, now it's brilliant. They've got so much attacking power. And we kick off with a Uruguay defender, plays for Independiente in Argentina. His name, Gaston Silva. First player in this uh, second pack. Uh, then we have a Portuguese uh, forward, plays for Lazio, formerly of Manchester United. That's Nani. Uh, he did well for Man United, you know, at, at the start and then sort of drops off. Number three in this pack is another Iranian, a defender from Olympiacos in Greece. His name is Izan Hasafi. You're the good couple of Iranians today. Number four is an Icelandic forward from Augsburg, Alfred Finn Bogesson. We might have him or not, I can't really remember. And the final player is Argentina goalkeeper, not Matt Ryan uh, and not Brad Jones, Mitchell Langerak. I think we have him. I think we have both of the uh, Australian keepers. Brad Jones isn't actually in the book. Pack number three. I can see a shiny in here already, so that's a good start. Uh, and we start off with a, a German defender from Bayern München. Mats Hummels is the first player in this pack. Uh, number two is the shiny, and it is a, a badge, and it is Korea. That's number two. Number three is a Nigerian midfielder from Las Palmas in Spain. His name is Etebo Ogenkaro. Of course, Nigeria... Uh, some defeat against England in a friendly recently. Focus, please. There we go. Um, first half are good for us. Second half was pretty terrible. Uh, next up, a Colombian forward, and it is Radamel Falcao, one of the best players to come out of Colombia. Him and who's the other one? James Rodriguez. And uh, the final player in pack number three is Senegalese midfielder, plays for West Ham. It's the Kiate kid. It's Sheku Kiate. Not really a kid. He is. Uh, He's 29, 28. Let's jump into pack number four. Let's see who's going to be in this one. We need to fill up the Legends page. That's the plan for today. Let's try and get some of those because we have very few. So in this pack, we have a Spanish midfielder, Real Madrid. Name is Marco Asensio. Um, the rumours that he took on Dua Lipa after the, uh, after the Champions League final. Don't know if that's true or not. Well played if he did. A uh, Tunisian forward from uh, Esperance Sportif de Tunis, a Tunisian side. Taha Yassin Kinesi. That sounds like Khaleesi at the back. It sounds like a Game of Thrones character. Next up, we have 
Uh, one of the best forwards in the world, Argentina forward from Juventus, Paolo Dybala, be leading the line for Argentina, maybe sitting ahead of Messi or alongside Messi, who knows. Uh, next up, we have a Swiss midfielder from Arsenal, Granit Xhaka. One of the two Shaka brothers. I think the other one plays in a different nation, though, doesn't he? There's Granite Shaka. If we would like to focus the title, the name, that would be nice. There we go. And then the final player in this pack is a Japanese defender from Marseille. His name is Hiroki Sakai. There he is. Next pack. Let's see who's in this one. And we start with a French midfielder, someone I'm pretty sure we already have, from PSG. Adrian Rabiot is the first player in this one. Number two is a Danish forward. It is the Lord himself, Niklas Bentner. Um, I think I read yesterday he's actually out of the World Cup. I think he's been ruled out. A uh, Brazilian midfielder from Barcelona. Of course, he was formerly at Spurs. Uh, then I think he went over to China and came back to Barcelona. Paulinho. So uh, Brazil gets another player for their page. We have a team sticker, and it's Sweden. Uh, I think they'll struggle to get out of their group. It's the one with Germany and Mexico, isn't it? That's a difficult group. And the final player in this pack is a Polish midfielder from Napoli, Piotr Zielinski. So there's, he, there's him. Into the next pack. I think this is number six. We've got... We've got a Swede from uh, Werder Bremen. It's a defender. His name is Ludwig Augustinsson. Uh, number two is a Saudi defender from Al Hilal, Osama Hosawi. I recognise that name, so I feel like we've already got him. Number three is a Senegal forward from Stade Rene in France. His name is Ismail Saar. So there's him. Then we have a, another team sticker. This one is Poland. I don't remember which uh, badges or team stickers we do and don't have, but there's Poland. And the final player in this pack, the final sticker, is a uh, Croatian forward from AC Milan, Nikola Kalinic. Next pack, uh, number seven, I think. I should be able to count to seven. We have uh, a Peruvian midfielder. Uh, it's not Marco, it's Andy Polo, plays for Portland Timbers in the USA. Andy Polo. And then we have a German midfielder from Bayern München. His name is Sebastian Rudi. And then we have a Spanish striker from Chelsea, Alvaro Morata. Then we have a Iceland uh, midfielder, Gilfie Sigurdsson, Everton midfielder. Because he was signed this season, started off poorly, but improved in the second half of the season. And then lastly, it's a Peru midfielder from Orlando City. His name is Yoshima Yotun. So there he is. Now, what was the page that was close to being done? It was Panama. We haven't got a Panama player yet. I think we're only missing about three or four stickers for that page, which is the closest to being done. But so far, we've yet to pick up any players from that nation. So that's not good. Into the next pack. And we start off with someone who we already packed today. And that's uh, Strilic, the uh, Croatian. We've already got him today. In fact, he was the very first ticker of the pack opening. Uh, got another Iceland player, they're coming along thick and fast now. Defender from Rostov, Sveri Ingassen. In fact, I think we've already got him today as well. That sounds familiar. Next up, we've got uh, another Iranian. Um, and again, I think we've already got this guy today from Amkar Perm. I think it was in the same pack, in, in the first pack. Uh, is a Talahi. So, is this just a complete repeat pack? I don't know. Uh, it's not. Next one we've got is a shiny sticker, and it is the uh, Poland badge. And the final player uh, is English. He's been in the news a lot this week as uh, Raheem Sterling. Uh, he played against Nigeria, got booked for diving, and he's been in the papers all week because of some tattoo that he's got, which he's totally entitled to get. That's all I'll say on that. I'm not going to go into that too much. Let's jump into the next pack. So, this pack, we have a uh, Colombian midfielder from Espanyol. His name is Carlos Sanchez. He's the first player in this pack. And then number two is a Swiss defender from Borussia Dortmund. His name is Manuel Akanji. Uh, Akanji, not quite sure how that's said, but there he is. Of course, pronunciation, I do my best. Uh, Colombian, again, the second Colombian in the pack uh, from Bayern, formerly Real Madrid. James Rodriguez, one of Colombia's most talented players. He was the best player at the 2014 World Cup. 
Uh, we have a stadium. Uh, we're missing a few of these. This one I'm not sure if we have or not, but it's Volgograd. Uh, there, that is. Got a 45,330 capacity. And the final player in this pack, Inter Milan, forward from Croatia, Ivan Perisic. Start off with uh, a forward from Saudi Arabia, plays for Al Shabab. His name is Nasser Al Shamrani. And the next player is a uh, Poland striker from Bayern München. It's uh, Robert Lewandowski. I wonder how much impact he'll have at the World Cup. Uh, Poland, oh, I'm unsure if they're going to get through Group H or not. I feel like it's going to be Colombia. And then either Poland or Senegal. Maybe Japan might even do something. That group is very open. Uh, England midfielder, uh, pretty certainly is a duplicate, Jordan Henderson, captain of Liverpool. Not captaining at the World Cup though, that's going to Harry Kane. Uh, then we have uh, another Carlos Sanchez, we've got one for Colombia. This is the Uruguayan one, the midfielder that plays for Monterrey. So uh, there are two Carlos Sanchezes at the World Cup. And uh, the final player in this pack, German forward from Bayern, Thomas Müller. I think this is pack number 11. So we'll see who's in this one. Still no Panama players. We do have our first serve of the day though. Plays for Guangzhou Evergrande in China. Midfielder Nemanja Gudelj. That's our first Serbian player today. Next up, uh, another Saudi. Plays for Al Hilal in Saudi Arabia. His name is Noaf Al Abed. There he is. And then next up, we have uh, our first Costa Rican of the video. Uh, plays for Deportivo in Spain. His name is uh, Celso Borges. And then we have uh, another Spanish player, Real Madrid midfielder, Isco. And then the final player in this pack is uh, Australian midfielder, plays for Millwall. He has made the squads for the World Cup. Tim Cahill, pretty sure he scored a beautiful goal in 2014. It might have been 2010, but Tim Cahill going to the World Cup. Into the next pack. I feel like we've got a lot of duplicates today. And yeah, uh, I don't think it's gone especially well, this one. Uh, this guy we already have uh, in this pack opening, German defender Matt Summels, we've already packed him today. Next up is a uh, Belgian defender from Barcelona, Thomas Vermaelen, of course he used to play for uh, Arsenal. Next up is Japanese defender from Galatasaray, Yuto Nagatomo. There we go. Uh, and then we have a, uh, another Brazilian centre-back from Paris Saint-Germain, Marquinhos. And then uh, we've got uh, another stadium. This one is Saransk, Mordovia Arena, 44,149 fan capacity. That's that pack. Uh, three left. Um, we've got uh, someone who, again, we already have today, Marco Asensio. We're getting a lot of dupes now. But there's Asensio again. Uh, then we have our Tunisian, uh, I think, again, we've already got today because I said his name sounded like Khaleesi. That's Khaleesi. So we're getting a lot of dupes. Uh, another Brazilian sticker, we're starting to get a few more now, there's uh, Fernandinho, of course the Man City midfielder. Uh, next up we have uh, an Egyptian midfielder from Al Ali, his name is Abdallah El Said. And then finally, uh, a team sticker, and it is uh, the 2010 champions Spain. Two packs left, uh, no Panama players, so I feel like we might have to wait a little longer to get that, finally! I've been waiting to see this guy all, all the whole time we've been doing the book. The Egyptian king himself, Mohamed Salah. Uh, of course, he might miss the first couple of games of the World Cup with the injury. Thank you, Sergio Ramos. But Salah, I finally got him. It's taken a while, but I finally packed Salah. That's the one player I wanted. We haven't got Messi yet, though, I don't think. Uh, player number two in this pack is Douglas Costa, Juventus and Brazil uh, forwards. Uh, next player is uh, Russian goalkeeper Igor Akinfaya from CSKA Moscow. Getting a few goalkeepers today, that's cool. Uh, Peruvian uh, forward from Monacas Morelia uh, in Mexico. His name is Raul Rui Diaz. And the final player in this pack is another goalkeeper. This one is from Tunisia. Plays for Al Batin in Saudi Arabia. His name is Eamon uh, Matlaufi. There we go. Last pack. Uh, let's see who is going to be in this one. Okay, we've got a Tunisian defender from Kasim Pasa in Turkey. His name is Siam Ben Yusuf. That's the first one. Then we have 
Uh, and another Egyptian from Al Ali, Rami Rabia, the defender. Next we have uh, from Japan, from Cerezo Osaka, it's midfielder Hotaru Yamaguchi. I feel like we already have him. Uh, Panama player, it might be one of the ones we need, I don't know, we only need about three or four. Plays for Huachipato in Chile, his name is Gabriel Torres, so that might be one that we need, I'm not quite sure. Uh, and the last player today is a Uruguayan defender from Lazio, Martin Caceres will be playing alongside Diego Godin at the World Cup. So 15 packs done, uh, I'll get the ones that we don't have in the book, I feel like there might not be a lot that we actually need, so we'll get them in the book. And then we'll assess where we are and how close we are to maybe finishing a team. All right, guys, we're back. And of those uh, 15 packs, 75 stickers, duplicates, uh, total of 23. So uh, about one in three were duplicates, which isn't too bad, to be honest. So let's see where we are with the book. Uh, we didn't manage to fill up the Panama page. We didn't get anything for this page either. So uh, didn't get anything there. Two stages we got today, we already had. Uh, we did not get any host cities. Zoom out a little bit. Uh, so onto the actual countries themselves. Then we've got a couple more Russians today. We're now only missing five stickers for Russia. Uh, that is the logo: Maria Fernandez, Samadov, Erokin, and Smolov. Saudi Arabia. We've got a few today. We're missing seven for Saudi Arabia. Uh, Egypt. We got Salah today at last. We're still missing eight for this page though. So work to do for Egypt. Uruguay. We've got a couple, I think, today. Uh, but we're still missing quite a few there. Six, I think. No, seven. Portugal is long away from uh, being done. Uh, we got Nani today, but that was the only Portuguese player we got. Uh, Spain's looking pretty good. It started off slowly, but now we only need five Spanish tickers, and that's Nacho, Ramos, Busquets, Thiago, and uh, David Silva on the right there. So Spain's looking really good. Uh, I don't think we've got a Moroccan today, so uh, we're still away, away from finishing Morocco. Iran made a little progress today, but we still need eight. France, uh, I think the only French players today we got was Rabio. We already had. I don't think we got another French player. Australia, we got a few today. We now need only six for Australia. Peru, we still need seven. We got a couple of Peruvians today. Andy Porolo we got. Uh, Denmark, uh, I think we only got Bentner today. Denmark's a long way away from being done. We still need nine. Argentina, we got uh, Dybala today, and uh, we also got Sergio Romero, but we still need seven. Iceland, we still need seven. We've got a couple more Icelandic players today. Croatia, we still need eight, so way away from finishing Croatia. Nigeria, only need five now. We got, uh, did we get one more today? I think we did. So I think we got this guy up here. Um, but yeah, we still need, we only need five for Nigeria, so that's looking pretty good. Brazil, starting to look a bit better now than it did. It took us a long time to get some Brazilians. We still need nine, but at least we're getting a few more players now. Switzerland, uh, we still need eight, so a way to go for Switzerland. Costa Rica, we still need nine. Uh, Serbia, we still need ten. Jesus Christ, Serbia's a long way away from done. Germany, we now need only six. We've got a couple more Germans today. Uh, no Mexicans today. We still need eight Mexican players and the uh, well, eight stickers. Uh, Sweden, we still need nine. Korea, we still need six. Belgium, we still need six. Panama, uh, we only got one today and it was someone we already had. And that was uh, Gabriel Torres down here. We still need Gabriel Gomez, uh, Mercado and the team. But Panama is our closest uh, to being filled. Tunisia, I think we've got one today. But we still need seven. England, we got Sterling today. We also got Henderson, who we already had, but we still need six, seven, eight for them. Poland, we still need seven, but we've got one or two more today. Senegal, we now only need five, so Senegal looking a bit better. Colombia, we still need, we only need four for Colombia now. That's looking good. Uh, who are they? Fabra, Davidson, Sanchez, Quadrado, and uh, I just I put Falcao in the wrong place. I put Falcao in the wrong place. Oopsie. Uh, it's meant it's here. It's meant to go up there. So whoever's there, we still need. And uh, Japan, we still need two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we didn't get anything again on uh, th this page, which is 
I just I don't think this page actually exists because we're never getting stickers for it. We've got the 1931 and we've got France 98. That's all we got, so that's no good. But that's the pay. That's the book. Got 15 packs left, which I'll be opening uh, again today, and then they'll be going out uh, either at the end of this week or at the start of next week. But they'll be out by the time the World Cup starts. I've got no chance of finishing this book, but hopefully we can at least complete a team. Uh, but that's going to do it for today guys thank you for watching if you've enjoyed the video make sure you give this video a thumbs up leave comments and if you want to see videos as on when this and up on youtube do hit that subscribe button uh hit the notification bell to receive the updates for when i upload or go live and follow me on social media so you don't miss any of my content thank you for watching and i will see you soon goodbye